Hello students, let's continue with the topic of Squares and Square Roots Today we are going to discuss how to estimate the square root of a number We know the square root of 25 is 5 The square root of 81 is 9 The square root of 225 is 15 The square root of 49 is 7 the square root of 64 is 8, and so on. Then our question is, what is the square root of 250? In such cases, we need to estimate the square root. We know that 100 less than 250, less than 400. We know, square root of 100 equals 10, and the square root of 400 equals 20. So, 10 less than the square root of 250, less than 20. But still, we are not very close to the square number. We know that, 15 square equals 225. 16 square equals 256. 15, less than the square root of 250, less than 16. 256, is much closer to 250, than 225. So square root of 250 is approximately 16. Let's do another example. Take square root of 500. We know 400, less than 500, less than 900. That is, 20 less than the square root of 500, less than 30. But still, we are not close to the square of the square root of 500. We know 22 square equals 484 and 23 square equals 529. 484 less than 500, less than 529. That is 22 less than the square root of 500, less than 23. Since 500 is close to 484 than 529, that is, square root 500 is close to 22. Therefore, square root of 500 is approximate 22. Let's recall what we learn. Today, we discussed how to estimate square root of a natural number. Before winding up, I will give an activity. Estimate the square root of 621. That's all for now. See you all in the next class.